Queensland's new Chief Justice has compared the abuse he's received since his appointment was announced as like he'd killed Bambi. Tim Carmody was sworn in today as legal heavyweight Tony Fitzgerald described the judicial system as irreversibly damaged. He walked into the Supreme Court a prominent QC and walked out just over an hour later Queensland's new Chief Justice. His preference for plain speaking intact. There was no traditional pomp, no public ceremony. Chief Justice Tim Carmody was sworn in in front of his family. We'll, we'll have a public event uh, in the not too distant future. You know, it's, um, uh, with the circumstances that uh, meant that a private um, swearing in was uh, unavoidable. The circumstances surrounding Chief Justice Carmody's appointment include widespread public criticism from organisations and bodies like the Bar Association, a former Solicitor General, a sitting Supreme Court judge, and again today, Tony Fitzgerald. The government had tried to appease the corruption fighter. I was very happy for, for Jeff to go and have a chat to Mr Fitzgerald because we value and respect his views. But today, not even safety glasses could shield the Premier from his wrath. If political egos do not prevent it from doing so, the government has time to correct many of its worst mistakes. Unfortunately, if its totally unsuitable choice is sworn in as Chief Justice, the damage to the courts and the independence of the judiciary will be irreversible. I'm sorry, but I just have to disagree with that. Chief Justice Sir Carmody has many, many supporters. Now, either way, any public argument is legally immaterial. Mr Carmody is Chief Justice until he steps down or turn 70 in 12 years' time. Michael Best, 9 News.